welcome in everybody today we are playing phasmophobia once again we are doing a chrysalaneous ghost hunt which is a, always a good time nothing bad will ever happen as we are well aware from past experiences if you're if you're unfamiliar with the series let me tell you what we're going to be doing here today the goal is to play around a phasmophobia and survive with properly identifying the ghost all right, the goal of the series is to identify every single ghost that is available in Phasmophobia. So far, we've done about 10 of them, and we've gotten a couple repeats. So if there's a repeat ghost, that just adds an additional week to the series. Um, I, I gotta say, we're going, <laughs> we're going strong. We've been doing a lot of these videos, but these ghosts, specifically the demon. So, like I said, we're trying to encounter every single ghost. Uh, we need to survive, we need to properly identify the ghost, which means we need to find all the pieces of evidence. In fact, if we find all the pieces of evidence and we don't survive, as long as we find all three, I count it as a, you know, properly identifying, it counts for the series. Uh, but this is always on solo, comma, slash, professional. Uh, so those are the only difficulties we do this on. And we finally have some money. So we got some good stuff today. We're gonna go in. Um, I used to not buy multiple dots projectors, but now I'm realizing that that is something we should do. So let's do an inventory check. We got two dots. We got one imp reader. We got a flashlight, two ghost books, one spirit box, one UV, two video cameras will be fine for what we're doing today, two tripods, two Sanos. Uh, I would say we definitely need more Sano pills. All right, let's hop into it, guys. What do we want to do? We'll do Grafton Farmhouse. Heck yeah, bro. Ready up. And remember, guys, when you're watching this video, let me know if you thought it was a different ghost earlier on, what your favorite house to play this game is, or if I missed something. If I missed something, do, do let me know as well. But let's jump back into it, see what's going on. God, if I could only pick up the key. So, if you aren't familiar, this game is a lot of fun, but they added... So this is, this is what I mean. There's 24 different ghost types, and the goal of this series is to have one encounter with every single one of them. So far, I think this is episode 20. Uh, we had an issue where they got mislabeled and the thumbnails are off. Blah, 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 blah. So I think we're on episode 20. So we're this series is at, <laughs> is at least going to be 30 episodes because we've gotten so many repeat ghosts. Like I know that we've gotten Demon four times, which means we're going to be at least 28 episodes in before we identify every single ghost. So that's sick. Do I have a flashlight? <gasps> no strong flashlight. Yo, we are we are brave today. <laughs> Oh my god. I don't believe this nonsense. Um, I really like the farmhouses. Some people don't, but I do. I do. I think they're fun. Can you guys see everything okay? I guess you can see everything about as well as I can. Look at all those spooks. There should be a breaker. There's not a breaker. That's fine. I feel like I haven't played this map in forever. I love this map. The This is Grafton Farmhouse, I believe. I know I just picked it, okay? But it's whatever, dude. Let's see what we got going on. Run through here. Close the door. Get to close all the doors behind us so we know when the ghost touches something. Um... See, I'll try to leave my flashlight on more so you guys can see things a little bit better, but you know, I do have to turn it off every now and again when I'm looking for ghost orbs. Doesn't look like there's any. Is there a cursed object in here? Someone have a cursed object? I don't know if any of the cursed objects appear in here. Breaker? Breaker, breaker, one nine. Big old flirt. Cursed object? Wow! <laughs> Goodbye. I didn't even click on it, homie. What the frick? 
If you don't say goodbye to it, you're in for a bad time. You're in for a bad time. Okay, everything looks good. So we can do like an EMF test. We can use the Ouija board. If we put an EMF reader by the Ouija board, uh, while we use it, it will go EMF 5 if the evidence type is EMF 5. So that's what we're going to test now. Because I'm a professional ghost hunter, baby! Just kidding. Well, I'm not really kidding. I am kind of a big deal. Okay, it's already EMF 5. What the heck? The big spooks. Hello. What's your favorite room? Where are you? Upstairs. God, this takes forever, dude. This takes forever. Upstairs what? Bathroom? Bathroom. Goodbye. Yo, big bet, big bet. I know, dude, I can talk to ghosts. I'm awesome. That was not the button I thought it was. But it still worked. <laughs> so they should be in the upstairs bathroom, like we said. Oh yeah, he'd be throwing things. Wow. So breaker should be in here. Yep. These houses are so haunted that I come here very regularly. I know that uh <laughs> Is it done yet? <laughs> I was just gonna say, I always know where the breaker is. <laughs> He's a slow ghost, too. Let's hop out of here. Whoa, dude. I don't know. I don't know about all this <laughs> nonsense here. This ghost is, uh, not being friendly, if you will. However, we did get our first evidence type with that, uh, EMF level 5. I'm pretty sure everything is still an option. Uh, but we got a good camera in there, which is awesome. Uh, yeah, dude, my sanity is shit. How did this happen? How did this happen to me? I made my mistakes. Oh, man, I want to take a... Well, if we drop the flashlight, we can turn some lights on along the way. And that should help us uh, be able to take three items without... Yes. Yes, 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 yes. There should be that one there. Oh. And right here. All right. So the strat is to put the book where you can see it. The dots where you can see them, but not where they're like abstracting your view if there are dots, you know what I mean? Uh, there's nothing really in here to take. Sh uh, show yourself? Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition! Where are you? Give me a sign. Your mom's a hoe. I said your mom's a hoe. What's your favorite room? Where are you? What's your favorite room? Can you hear me? How old are you? Do you ever get nervous? Are you single? Goodbye. I don't know if the EMF counts, but I'm doing it anyway, because I think it counts. Okay, he touched that door. Do I have sanity left? I do. I just saw that door move, which means we can do this. Uh, motion sensor candle. 
Don't have the candle, okay. But since he just touched that door, we should be able to get some fingies. Unless it's not a fingies ghost. Does not appear to be a fingies ghost. I am gonna put this more like right here. Like that's a little bit better. I'm gonna leave that shut. Yeah, there's no, uh, no nothing. Gotta go up there with the spirit box, see if we can get anything. We also need to just watch for a second to see if we can get some dotties. I thought that ghost was gonna kill me, bro. I thought I was a goner. Okay. What you got for me here, ghost? What you got? Dots! Dun 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 dun! Nice. Nice. Alright. It was very faint. It was kind of hard to see, so. Ghost riding is out. Damn. I can still be spirit box. I can still be everything except ghost riding. But it doesn't look like ghost orbs, so. Spirit box. Okay, those are dots, not spirit box. <laughs> Where are you? Okay, so it is working cool. Um, we have a candle, or we have a lighter, but we don't have a candle, so that's unfortunate. Okay, this is big spooks, because I don't really have a light. Where are you? Are you here? Look at that mirror and the screen light, it's so freaking spooky. Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Does not appear to be the spirit box. So we'll just keep it moving, keep it trucking along. I don't even know what our objectives are. I keep looking at them and not like taking them in. You know what I mean? I don't really know what to do exactly. Oh, freezing temps, duh. No, I put a thermometer in here. Oh no. I'm pretty sure I put their mother in here. What the heck? Oh god. Okay, give me flashlight. Can I also have flashlight, please? Well, we have to go make sure. What the heck? We have to go make sure the breaker is on. I'm also going to take the dots down because now that we have dots, it just gets in the way of seeing orbs. So that BB over here. So now the only way we can really test for freezing temps is if we see our breath in the area. I don't know if I've ever seen the ghost actually close a door before. Um, I've seen them open them, but that was kind of kind of new, I guess you would say. <laughs> but I I did take some pictures of the doors, so if it's fingerprints, it should count. Let's find out. Incredibly flammable home. <laughs> At the table would make sense for there to be a candle. And the kitchen would also make sense for there to be a candle. There appears to be no candles. <coughs> Every once in a while. Yo, does this count as a candle? No, it doesn't. That's stupid. That is totally a candle. I think it has to be freezing temps, and I'm just not getting him. Oh, breaker's off. That would explain not getting the freezing temps. Typically, you won't get freezing temps unless, uh, you know, the, the power's on. I don't know why it works that way, but it does. Oh, that's why I dropped the camera. It's out. Give me the freezing temperatures. Name. Something you need in your haunted house. Freezing temperatures. Boy. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. I like that answer. Freezing temperatures. Show me my breath. Okay, buddy. That was awful. Prince?
Did I not leave a camera in the bathroom? I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, this is the bathroom. Well, I witnessed a ghost event, which is helpful, I guess. Yeah, I thought he turned the breaker off, but he really just turned the, uh... Okay, he turned the breaker off. Man, I hate when they do this to me. Regularly turning off the breaker. Things are starting to not look so good for us here. Okay, he just touched the door. Not sure what door, but... Fingies. Fingies. I'm wondering why there's no evidence at all. Freezing temps, spirit box, ghost orbs. I mean, it could be spirit box and I've just been in the wrong area. Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? I don't really want to use this right now because it drains your sanity pretty bad, but... Where are you? Are you here? Man, this is stressful. There's not even EMF 5 in here anymore. Where's the EMF 5? I'm definitely hiding behind this crib when something goes wrong. <laughs> I'm wondering if the ghost migrated downstairs, because they can change rooms at certain points. I just need one last piece of evidence, dude. What the heck? I could totally see it switching to the other bathroom. Gosh, this is... What a stupid bathroom. That's so scary. <laughs> okay, looks like there's no EMF here. I'm sorry, guys. I don't mean to waste your time. It's this ghost. He doesn't care about our time as human beings. He once was one, and now he just doesn't care about us. Because if I get EMF in a different room then uh, it would make sense why I'm not getting my third oh, bone piece of evidence upstairs. You know what I mean? Let's take this and go somewhere. Go somewhere safe. I'm going to ask him where he is. Yes, the mattress is here. This is such a good hiding spot. Okay, I don't, I didn't, oops. Okay. Didn't mean to hit all those. Hello. All right, click on it. Where are you? What's your favorite room? Where are you? Stairs. Goodbye. If I die, you know what to do. Go to twitch.tv slash chrysalaneus and follow me. It's still upstairs bathroom. That's what it says. I don't know what to tell you. There's only one upstairs bathroom, too. Like, I can't be getting this wrong. There's no ghost orbs. Spirit box doesn't want to work. Let's see what an Oni does. I'll give it to me. If it's if it's an Oni, I don't think we've encountered Oni. I'll say we have it identified it if we agree with the behavior aspect. More active when people are nearby and have been seen moving objects. Very active, making them easier to find. And it doesn't sound like this guy. Interesting. Interesting, Raiju. Interesting. Let's try Wraith. <clears throat> One of the most dangerous ghosts you will find. It is also the only known ghost that has the ability of flight and has sometimes been known to travel through walls. 
We can do a wraith test. This is the last thing we're gonna do. And uh, then we're gonna call it. We're gonna make a decision after this. I don't think it's a uh, Raiju, because if it was a Raiju, I would assume he would want to leave these lights on. You know what I mean? I just needed to step in salt. That's all I need to do. And that gives me at least one way to narrow up, narrow down my choice. It's the ash swinging, the dash swinging, the ash swinging. Why you gotta play me like that, bro? He didn't even step in the salt. All right, we're done. We're done after that one. Yeah, we've we've done uh, everything we can. I'm not I'm not hanging around after that nonsense. Okay. So Wraith, Wraith have some kind of reaction to that. Have a toxic reaction to salt. Wraiths can almost never touch the ground, meaning it can't be tracked by footprints. I'm gonna go Wraith. I think I think this just makes the most sense because I don't think I don't think it's a Raiju. An Oni kind of doesn't make sense either. Wraith at least makes sense. Spirit box, yeah, it could. Spirit box is iffy sometimes. I'm calling it. I don't care what you guys say. If this is it, then it counts. But I think we've already encountered a wraith. We'll see. Da 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 da. What is it? A wraith! <laughs> Hallelujah. I think we've already encountered a wraith, though. Oh my lanta! This is a new ghost! Which is absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. Thank you guys for watching another Chrysalaneous Ghost Hunt. You know I have a lot of fun with these videos, and I appreciate y'all watching every week. Uh, there's a new one every Wednesday, and we have some great editors coming in to help me make these videos a little more exciting for you. So leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what your favorite thing about this episode was, and make sure you check me out at twitch.tv slash chrysalaneous. See you next time.